What's up everybody, Tactical 7 here, back into the Minecraft mod tutorial. Today's mod tutorial will be on the Chococraft mod, and what this mod does is it adds a new mob to Minecraft called the Chocoboo, and this mob is tameable, and you can also breed it. So let me go ahead and hop in my world, and I will show you everything about this mod. Okay, so you can see I have two chocoboos right in front of me. And to tame them, what you use is a Gisal, Gisal Greens. I believe that's how you pronounce it. So let me go ahead and tame this guy before he runs away. Like he already is. Okay, there we go. Only took one for that guy. Let's go over here and tame this one. Took quite a few for them. Okay. So as you can hear, they do make their own custom noises. Let me see if I right click. Come on, follow me. Oh wait, whoops, I just used the um, the whistle to untame them, okay. So if you right click them again after you tame them, they will follow you. So now I have them following me and I can use a saddle to ride them let me go ahead and show you how to craft the saddle let me turn off the rain so to craft the saddle you need two pieces of string put a leather right in the center and then a chocobo feather and that'll give you your saddle and when you put a saddle on them they will not move from where they're at they just stay put once you um, place it on them and then to ride them of course you just right click and they are pretty fast a lot faster than what the uh, normal walking speed would be but if you want it to follow you just take a chocoboo feather um, when it has a saddle on it and simply right click it and it will follow you So now I will try to breed them, and you can either give them golden gasals or loverly gasals, and I'll go ahead and show you how to craft both of those. So for the golden gasals, this is a more um, demanding recipe because of the gold nuggets, but you take four chocobo feathers, put them in the corners like this, and then take your golden nuggets and put them around the edges. And then you take a normal Gasol greens and put it in the center, and that will give you your golden Gasol. And now to craft the Loverly, we need to get this out. Okay. And we put it like this. And that will give us our Loverly Gasol. So I'm going to go ahead and tame them with a golden Gasol. Or not tame them, breed them. So if we give that one one, we give this one. Hmm. I'm thinking they can't be... Oh, there it goes. I had it stuck to stay there. So here we go. This is called a Chikaboo, which is just a baby Kokaboo. Or Chokaboo. And then we also have a cake right here. Let me go ahead and just set this cake down. Why can't I set it down? Okay, for some reason it's not letting me set the cake down. Um, I don't know if that's just a bug or what. Okay, come on guys, move. You're making this hard for me. So I'll go ahead and show you how to craft the cake last. So to craft the cake, you take milk, put three across the top, two sugars on the side in the second row, and then a gasol greens, and then three wheat across the bottom. And there you go, your, your gasol cake. And the last thing I'll show you how to craft is the um, wild chocobo whistle. And you just take a gold ingot and then put a chocobo feather underneath. And what this does when you use it, 
on the Kogaboos, it will untame them. So you can see they're no longer tamed. And yeah. So that is the Chocoboo mod. Or Choco Craft Chocobo Choco Craft mod. So I now need to clean up my Minecraft jar. After I do that, I'll be back and I will show you how to install this mod. Okay, so what you're going to need to install this mod is some sort of archiving program such as WinRAR, 7-Zip, or WinZip. All these archiving programs will work the same, so you can use whatever you prefer. I will be using WinRAR in this tutorial. Then you're going to need to download Audio Mod, Mod Loader, and the ChocoCraft mod itself. So to get Audio Mod, Mod Loader, and the ChocoCraft model, go ahead and give you the link to these two pages in the description. So for the ChocoCraft, we go ahead and scroll down to where it says download and just go ahead and click on the ChocoCraft link. But before you do that, you can go ahead and scroll down and you can see all the recipes and all the information on the mod. But to download it, just go ahead and click on the link. And this will take us over to an ad fly. And it'll say, please wait five seconds up in the top right hand corner. It's been a little bit slow. There it goes. After five seconds is up, a yellow button that says skip ad will appear. Just go ahead and click on that. And that will take us over to a media fire and just go ahead and click on download to download the mod. Now for audio mod and mod loader, go going to go ahead and come over to Resogami's mods and scroll down until you see mod loader 1.1 and you can either do download from AdFly or direct, whatever you prefer to do. I usually tend to do direct because I can just download it straight from this page. So after you download mod loader, go ahead and scroll down a little bit more until you see audio mod 1.1 and again you can either do download from AdFly or direct, whatever you prefer to do. So that is how to download everything that you're going to be installing. So when you're ready to install it, go ahead and come over to start, then type in percent app data percent. Just like this down here. And go ahead and go into your roaming. Then open your dot minecraft. Now go into your bin. Left click your minecraft jar, then right click it and do open with and select whatever archiving program you're using. I'm using WinRAR, so I'm going to go ahead and open it with WinRAR. Now your bin, we will be coming back to this later on in the tutorial, so go ahead and just minimize that for now. Do not close it. So once you have Minecraft jar open, go ahead and open up Audio Mod, and highlight these three files and drag them into your Minecraft jar, and hit OK. Go ahead and close Audio Mod. Now open up Mod Loader, and highlight all these class files and drag them into your Minecraft jar, and hit OK. Go ahead and close Mod Loader. Now open up the ChocoCraft mod and you do not want to put the resources file into your minecraft jar so go ahead and just take the choco file and then drag it into your minecraft jar hit ok and then highlight the class files and drag them into your minecraft jar as well and hit ok now remember do not put the resources file into your minecraft jar so after you did that go ahead and delete meta inf if you do not see meta inf in your minecraft jar it's ok you can go just skip this step so go ahead and just left click then right click it and select delete files then hit yes and that will delete meta inf you want to make sure you always delete meta inf when you're installing a mod or else if you don't it'll make your minecraft crash so now you're done with your minecraft jar you can go ahead and close that and you should have minimized your bin so bring that back up and hit back and now this is where we're going to put the resources file you're going to put it into your dot minecraft folder so take your resources and drag it into your my dot minecraft folder hit yes and there you go you're done installing this mod so I hope this video helped you guys out. Thank you for watching, and I'll see you guys next time.